on the tennis court. He'd be extremely competitive. He was ranked 17th by that time. But off the tennis court, he wasn't a competitive guy. He was open-minded, uh, very cooperative, uh, kind of guy that everyone liked. He was smart, he was soft, and generous. There was this quality of, of people being very loyal to him. he just done all the things that you would ever hope for someone to be able to accomplish and had had everything in front of him. Fate sent him a very bad blow, but then he flew very high with it anyway. I was embarrassed by by my inability to perform as people ordinarily perform. All I could do was see his body. As time went on, there was something about his energy and his humor that made him feel as normal as I was normal. I think people were bewildered by my being attracted to a totally disabled individual. He already had his MD. So he could make a choice about further study and specialty. We all thought psychiatry for Arnie. As I began to try to understand how people thought and behaved, uh, I began to apply that to the athletic observations that I was making. His disability was a profound influence on athletes. It allowed them to say, this man knows what's inside of me about how I identify myself. And if you take that away, I'm not sure I have anything left. Who knew that better? Ani wrote an article in commemoration of Fritz's 75th birthday called The Paradoxical Theory of Change. Fritz thought that Arnie's article was the most useful and the best article of all of the presentations in the Festschrift. His relationship with Fritz was very important to him. I think Fritz helped him clarify his ability to deal with his uh, disability and not feel like it was a burden to people and let him be more comfortable with having to have people help him. When I was no longer able to teach because I didn't have enough air to speak, I started writing and that was something of a substitute for me. So there's always some opportunity, I think. People often ask me, what would your life have been like if you hadn't been disabled? I say, I don't know, this is the only life I've ever lived. Of course, that's the thing with Arnie. People were lucky to meet him. <laughs> <laughs>